Hey guys, Samsung Help here, and I wanted to talk about the Galaxy S8. Just kidding. What's up, guys? I do myself here. Today, I want to talk about the Galaxy S8. I've had it for about 24 to 48 hours, and I wanted to test or revisit the security feature built into the phone facial recognition. As you may have heard already, the facial recognition feature can easily be compromised using a photo, but did Samsung really fix that with the final product? Those bypasses that we saw using the facial recognition feature was with demo models, demo galaxies. So I want to go ahead and try have a picture of myself here and I wanted to see if I can unlock the phone using the facial recognition so first I'm gonna use my face of course there it is I'm pointed to the camera here there it is it unlocks let me go ahead and do that again so you guys can see there it is so it unlocks using my face right so I want to see if you can still bypass it using a photo so here's a photo of me I'm gonna go ahead and point the galaxy Go ahead and tap here, it says to use facial recognition. And can we get it to work? Doesn't look like it's working. I think they might have fixed it. Let's see, let me hold the iPad. I have an iPad here. Keep in mind, anyone can find a photo of you on the internet. So this is why I am testing this. Oop, there it goes. It unlocked. You saw that? Let me go do that again. There it goes. Once you get the hang of it, it's really easy to do. So Samsung has yet to fix the facial recognition security feature built into the Galaxy. Now they did put out a statement that they said that this feature isn't the most secure. It's more like a slide to unlock a feature to get access to your phone quickly. But a lot of people will probably end up using this because it is so quick and it is so easy cool to use honestly but uh, the statement they say is sort of like the slide to unlock the difference is that when slide to unlock you have to enter your passcode to get into the phone with this you won't have to enter the passcode someone can just find a photo of you unlock the phone and then it's going to be compromised so I don't think the statement is correct from Samsung that they say this is just a slide to unlock intuitive feature. They need to find a way to fix this because the fingerprint scanner is all the way up here. So nobody is really going to end up using that unless they have really big hands or something. Or the iris scanner which at night it works as well but just not as well as it should. So we're, we automatically fall back to the slide to unlock and entering your passcode. At least I did because of the facial recognition being so cool but I can't can't use it because I don't feel safe using it. The iris scanner just doesn't work all the time. I have to hold my phone in an awkward position to get it to work sometimes. And the fingerprint being all the way up here with my little hands. Uh, and I'm sure a lot of people have the same issue. I can't really reach it. Not to mention it's next to the camera and I keep hitting the camera instead of the fingerprint sensor but anyway i love the phone honestly not really raining down on samsung's party but it's just something that i wanted to revisit because it is very important for those who are using the new galaxy to understand that the new galaxy sa can still be bypassed under the facial recognition feature. Uh, keep in mind that Samsung also put out a statement saying that you can't use the facial recognition for the secure folder or Samsung Pay, but still you can get into the phone, which is one of the biggest flaws. So there you guys have it. Just wanted to revisit that security feature built into the Galaxy. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Please share this information to educate more people about it. It's been iDevice Help, and I'll catch you guys really soon. Peace.